Hey guys, in this comprehensive tutorial, I will show you how we can edit this image quickly and make the skin glow with beautiful skin tone. With no further ado, let's get started. If you need to retouch your image, you can use the AutoFace FX action, which is a one click retouching action. With just one click, you can see how it's retouched our image for us. Here was the before, and here is the after. It doesn't just retouch the face, it retouches the whole image from the head to the full body you can see here was the before and here is the after it retouch the skin while retaining the skin textures it retouches the skin while retaining the skin textures you can see the before and the after so you can get the auto face fx action link will be in the description next thing we are going to do we are going to create a solid color adjustment and in the solid color adjustment right down here we are going to insert this secret hair code b3 six c two e so if you wonder how i got this hair code i have over 54 hair code i use for getting amazing skin tone i've used them for a long period of time i already know them off head over 54 different hair code that matches all the skin tone so if you subscribe to this channel you're going to see me use all of them one after the other and i'll go into more details on how to easily use them i have an action for it but i'm not using the action in this video so that you can actually use it independently on your skin tone by just creating a solid color adjustment inserting this hair code and getting this rich beautiful skin tone you can see the before and the after and i'm going to come to the layer max and i'm going to image i'm going to click on apply image and you're going to click on ok and yeah, I'm going to come right here to the properties. Make sure you're on the layer max. Now invert this. You see the before and you see the after. You see the before and you see the after. We want this only on the skin tone. So we are going to create a group. In the group, we are going to create a layer max. And we are going to invert the layer max. So come to the layer max properties and then invert the layer max. Take your brush, make sure the foreground is white. The flow should be around 60. Increase your brush size and paint on the skin to review this effect like this. So you take your time to brush this only on the skin. Make sure it doesn't bleed into the outfit because if you zoom closely right now, you can see how it's affecting the black outfit negatively. You can still make sure you take your brush. This time the foreground should be black if you want to remove this effect from areas you don't want it to be applied like the outfit area like this reduce your brush size and paint on areas that you need to remove it if you are doing it for your own image you take your time we should not waste unnecessary time showing you what you already understand so i'm going to zoom out right now i'm going to take a look at the before and the after here was the before and here's the after with just the solid color you can see we've enriched our skin tone next we are going to create a curve create a curves adjustment now make sure you're on the auto fix a layer make sure you're on this layer now you come to channel i'm going to load channel as selection and it's going to create the selection for you come back make sure you're right here now you take your curves up like this make sure you create a point at the midpoint take the curves up like this now come to the layer marks delete this layer marks by dragging the layer marks to this there's been an icon down here Delete the layer max and create a new layer max by clicking on this icon right here, add layer max. And this is what you are going to get, this before and this is after. Now you are going to create a group for this. Now you are going to create another layer max for the group. Now come to image, come to apply image. And now you click on OK. And I'm going to come down here. I'm going to reduce the opacity. You're going to reduce your opacity like this and now you take a look at the before and the after right now with just this adjustment we have made our skin glue right here in photoshop before and after don't forget you can always reduce the opacity finally to bring everything together we are going to create a stand visible layer with ctrl shift alternate e if you are using a pc press ctrl shift alternate e if you are using a mac press command option shift e to create a stand visible come to filter now come to camera roll filter in the camera roll filter you can come 
right here to the edit and click on the auto to see the result it gives you so by clicking on the auto you can see the before and after it's already looking amazing by clicking on the auto camera raw ai is going to go into your image and try to fix things in a basic section it's going to fix the lights and the colors you see it boosts the vibrance and it desaturates the image and you see the adjustment mix to the light it adjusts the exposure the contrast the highlight the shadows the whites and the black now you can come and further refine this adjustment sometimes or for some image the result doesn't look nice so that one you are going to undo the auto and manually fix things for yourself but for this i think it has given us a good starting point to further refine our adjustment so you see right here you see the adjustment we are making to the blacks and to every other area of the image and you can see the before and the after now click on ok to come back into photoshop you're going to reduce opacity greatly reduce opacity all the way to 30 see the before and the after now let's take a general look at the before and the after here was the before and here is the after if you watch this video all the way to this point you might have learned something new and amazing and you can see that we use the auto face fx action which is a one click action to smooth our image take it from looking this rough to looking this smooth so you can get the auto face fx action the link is in the description to get it link is in the description the auto face fx action is just one dollar with just one dollar contribution to the channel you get the auto face fx action that will automatically retouch your image for you if you find it difficult to get the auto face fx action you can write to me on gmail at slamming photography at gmail.com or you can send me a dm on instagram at slamming photography underscore 